Dani Justino. People know my nickname Chris Cyborg. I'm from Brazil, but now I'm living in the United States. Uh, I'm born in Curitiba, semi city Vandalay Silva, Shogun, Ninja, a lot of fighters, Brazilian fighters from my city Curitiba and Sul Silva. I started training 12 years old, but before I, I met, always I liked sports and I played, but handball player and running competition, everything about fighters. And I never, I never have a trouble kid, you know, in school, but I always try to be athlete. And when I was play handball, somebody else, my black belt from shooter box, he is watching my play game and he asking me, say, I, I like fight, he said I watch fight Vandalay Silva Shogun, he think I'll be a great fighter and he gave me the card from Shooter Box for me can try my first class in Muay Thai. But I don't give it attention because attention because I don't you know I don't like it fight before and only train and study and but he keep going, see me at the train and always he asking me and I try. I did my first train in shooter box with Rafael Cordeiro, and I love. I did it three months Muay Thai, and always I love compete. I like I like compete, and in three months I did Muay Thai. I asked my coach I want to make one fight because you know I I, like, I think when you train something you have to compete for I don't know you learn and you motivate you keep training, and I asked him for make one fight. And he said, you see, and in six months I did my first fight, but no Muay Thai, I did MMA. And I trained a couple things in Jiu Jitsu, defense takedown, but always I started in Muay Thai. And I did my first fight, I'm not winning, I'm lost, but but I, I this fight for me, I think, uh, I know I'm not happy because I don't want no win fight, but show me you know i'm born for the fighter you know before i play handball and run but when i did my first fight i love and i keep training i keep going now i'm here you know before i never follow you know mma but i watch a couple fights mike tyson with my father and you know so late 2 a.m and always i i sleep before but i follow with my father mike tyson and but before i never follow nobody and when I start training, and I watch Vanille, Shogun, Fedor, Menenko, looks like my mirror. So in the beginning, uh, I don't tell my mom I train, and I, I put him. I have gloves, but I never show her. Sometimes I have a, um, purple eyes or something, but I always tell her about handball, not about the fight. And after my first fight, I told her. I start training and she say no, it's no good. I don't want my daughter fight, and I don't pay good school for keep fighting. And but you know, I follow my dream, and I mean, you know, I think I have to do what you want to do it, be happy. And when I start MMA, I like and and my mom after that now she's follow me. She's like you fight, but before hard, you know, hard you you're only you daughter and I have one brother too but only you want to be fighter you know and uh, punch somebody somebody punch you and I think it's no no but now my mom know it's professional and it's sport when I started I started Muay Thai and I like I like to be stand up I like strike punch knee and but I like Jiu Jitsu too wrestling and, because I did my first fight, my MMA fight, but before I did my training first Muay Thai. And, you know, I started in Muay Thai, I like Muay Thai, but um, I st my first fight in MMA, and I keep going in MMA, and when they don't have fight, MMA fight, and make Muay Thai fight, I think good experience for me, I keep continue training, continue compete. But, you know, I, I like buffs, I like buffs. You know, I, I started Muay Thai, shooter box, and I learned a little bit, you know, you don't learn a lot about Muay Thai, but you train, and a couple of people come to Thailand and teach a couple of things you learn, and I have my dream coming, you know, coming to Thailand and coming through, and I have put my friend come here, Marcio Gracia, and he asked me if I come, can come, and for me, it's a big deal, because I learned more about Muay Thai, I learned more... Uh, 
white crew and I learned new things and I want to come here in Thailand every year I think you know change my mind a little bit about Muay Thai and I respect more people who train Muay Thai, people from Thailand and I love it here. And Phuket top team and I come stay with your boy and the other fighters and I train everything, I know only Muay Thai. People think when you come to Thailand you train only Muay Thai. You know when you have Muay Thai fighter you can train only Muay Thai but I think you have keep training, you have other training shoe, other options, you can train Jiu-Jitsu, you can train wrestling, and you can train boxing. And here I train everything because I have fight in December, and I think I keep going. And the MMA fighter I have to learn, but I try to learn more I can Muay Thai. And for sure I come here more times, and I think two months it's small time, it's a little time for learning a lot. Of I come here for training, but I enjoy the place too, and train all weekend. In the weekend I try, you know, learn couple things Thailand and go different place meet good great people and I like here because people very humble very respectful people and I like this and I go event watch a couple of my ties fight and good and you see the kids start training and compete and for me it's amazing and you see kids fight and you you know you think what is thing that people kids think about you know and we think because it, it work, you have to work, and the kids, little kids train, and you learn a lot of things from these kids. Uh, I will fight in Victor FC, I tried my first fight 135 in Victor, December 5, I think December, and I don't know the date yet, but I don't know my opponent yet, but I know it's MMA, and for sure I'll be ready, same the last fight, and I try my the best. And I, I try make 135, and after this fight, you have good news. I don't know. You know, everybody knows about this fight. I always I fight 145, and I know I don't make 135. I think it cannot possible fight her because she say she's make 140 or 145 only for Gina Karan. And you know, I try my the best for my fans, my family, and for me too. And I wanted this fight, and I try my the best make 135. For can this fight happen and, and for sure be ready and I hope so. I want to say thank you for all my fans, thank you for people following me and always send for me positivity and good vibes and say God bless everybody and follow me December my next fight and help keep people pray for me, make 135 and I'm very excited for this and I say thank you for Chito, for punishment family for my family in Brazil, for Shooter Box Gym, for Boyd from Poker Top Team, Ray, everybody can help me, all the coaches, and say thank you, thank you for you.